Hey, what's up everybody? This is Hawk Mikado, the Funnel Genius, and I am so glad to be working with Nathan, Mr. Funnel Fix-It, who is uh, one, a pure genius when it comes to making sure your funnels work properly. And uh, I've actually been a client of his for quite a while. He was a, uh, been a client of ours, and we decided to partner up on this software because we wanted to make sure that you as a funnel builder could easily go and hack funnels basically instantly. And we're actually going to demo that today. So I uh, appreciate you for jumping on, jumping on. Yeah, no problem. This will be fun. Absolutely. So uh, we, I know this is not live yet because there's still a couple of edits. Uh, first of all, what we're going to be demoing today is uh, replicating a live page into your own ClickFunnels account. Uh, but what's going to happen with that is it's not going to put in all of the dummy decks. So we're currently working on that. So this is not out for, uh, public use yet, but the, uh, editor to editor version is. So we've got, uh, basically a, a, an old version and then we have the new version that we're working on. It's going to be a part of a monthly subscription option. Uh, and for those of you who are lucky enough to become beta testers, uh, you guys are going to uh, be able to get in at a super, super low investment. And plus, you're also going to get access to a ton of amazing bonuses. And one of those bonuses is lifetime access for becoming one of our beta testers. So we're limiting, I don't know if you guys saw, but there have been over 100 people who said that they were interested in being beta testers. We're not taking 100 people, so... Uh, it is on a first come first serve basis. We're probably going to do about 20, maybe 30 beta testers at most so that you guys can give us your feedback and then be able to use this for you and your clients. So awesome, Nathan, why don't you go ahead and uh, take it away and show us how this works. Yeah, cool. Let me share my screen. All right. So, uh, one of the most powerful, uh, uh, scripts that I came across was understanding whether you're actually in a ClickFunnels page. Now, for, for a long time, um, especially anyone that's been doing any sort of funnel hacking, um, finding out what the current um, system... Uh, <laughs> you're quite welcome to that if you guys want to give me a call. Um, the Finding out what the current system is that you're going to be funnel hacking. Um, and there's a bunch of tools, and I've got a, a Chrome extension um, that tells me things like if it's a WordPress site or if they're using certain um, plugins or certain types of JavaScript or where they're hosting and things like that. So I've, I've always got that sort of stuff. I've got, I've got a whole bunch of Chrome extensions that help me with that. Uh, when I came across a, a script by um, uh, Jamie Smith that would um, actually open up, if you knew this was a, a ClickFunnels page and you owned it, you could click a button and it would open that page. Well, hang on a minute. If we can actually tell that this is a ClickFunnels page, what if we could show that up because that doesn't actually show up in any of these tools. When, um, uh, fast forward a few months, uh, Hawk and I were working on something. I thought, we know that there's actually code on this page that actually tells ClickFunnels where to put the elements and how to edit it. So um, that, was the, that was the chocolate and peanut butter moment where we, we mashed everything together and went, oh, I've got this great idea. What if we had a page and a Chrome extension? I'm just gonna move us out the way here, that's what that black box is, that would say, hey, all of a sudden, I understand this is a ClickFunnels page. What if you click copy? And then I go into my editor and I add a new step. And uh, this is Hawk's uh, one of the funnel magazine. Which by the way, that, that funnel is crushing it. <laughs> I bet, I bet. Thank, thank you, Mr. Brunson, I guess. You've got some, uh, some awesome guests in there too. Yes, we do. Uh, before, before you actually show it in the editor, go, can you open the page up live just so they can see it, you know, see this page once, once you've created. Uh, so here's the live, here's my page on funnelmagazine.com. Uh, and then go to, back to your so, editor. So my little Chrome extension popped up with a color and yep. it's now gone blue. So it was gray. I've got them both here to show you. It was gray. I loaded up a ClickFunnels page. If I go to, uh, let's go to Google just to show you. If I go to Google, um, it's gray. It stays gray. This is not a ClickFunnels page. If I go to a... Um, not yet. <laughs> soon, soon. If I go to WordPress, I go to a WordPress site. This is a WordPress site because it's wordpress.com. Nothing. 
So um, I didn't realize he was going to let me straighten into, into WordPress there, but never mind. Um, so one, uh, one thing that we are going to do, by the way, guys, is in, ver I think it's, it's either version four or five, we're actually going to be setting it up so it'll replicate WordPress, it'll replicate lead pages, it'll replicate uh, um, HubSpot, Insta pages, Entre pages, literally every single platform out there, we're going to be able to replicate those instantly into your ClickFunnels. So that is coming. All right. So what we're going to do, we've just created a page. Now, um, this was another little aha that we had. We get a whole bunch of tasks come to us where people have gotten their entire funnel built. They've spent days, if not weeks, building out their funnel, and it's absolutely perfect. And then they get into the ClickFunnels group or they, they, they come onto our group or they get basically pulling their hair out saying it's not working. When they get to the OTO, it doesn't work. It either skips the page or it clicks and just spins and spins and spins and says working and I'm losing sales. What can I do? And it turns out they've chosen either an OTO or a downsell page by mistake from the templates here when they've chosen the page and they've built their entire page could be a long form sales letter that's taken them weeks and weeks and weeks to build out and they've built it in the wrong template. Now you can save to a template and use a whole bunch of things. You can save rows and all that sort of stuff, but sometimes it just doesn't work. You're missing elements. And if you're going element by element, if you've got a long form sales page, it's still going to still take a long time. So um, uh, that's another one of these big, big ahas with this. You can replicate pages immediately using the same tool. So grab the page. It's on the wrong type. Oh no, grab the order page or grab the OTO page. It needs to be a downsell. Create a new page, select the downsell template, and then bang, one button press, and it's completely copied the whole page over. So uh, we, we've got a, an opt-in form. We can choose any template. It doesn't really matter. Um, I just use the first one because it's right there. We just need it to actually open up in that template type so that the page name type um, is still called whatever you want it to be. So opt-in in this case. So can uh, we open that up in a, oh, before you go in the editor, open up the page as a, so we can just see the page live. Let's, let's take a look at this live. Yeah. So this is the page live. Just so you know, we're, we're not rising you here. You can see this and it says funnel magazine, funnel dash magazine two is the URL top. Yeah, so I'm going to go into the editor. By the way, uh, while you're, while you're kind of showing this, uh, quick story. So somebody actually, uh, in the uh, click funnels group posted that they had deleted their entire page on accident. And, um, this is, by the way, if you go into click funnels, they'll tell you this is not possible to do. Um, but I don't believe in impossible because yeah, I just don't believe that anything's impossible. So I took the same thing that we're going to do here and I was able to go pull up a version of the page uh, that had been deleted on uh, from Google and I was able to replicate it and put it right back into his account and uh, save literally save them hundreds of hours. Uh, yes. If your if your page is cached somewhere, um, you've even got uh, old versions of your page. If you've deleted it, the history is obviously gone. But if it's hit the Wayback Machine, yeah, fantastic. That's a great idea. Yep. So uh, there's yeah. So there's always Call ways to the rescue. <laughs> All right. So let's uh, let's get this page and let's put some. Uh, actually, right, you so you know, <laughs> you know, so it went blue when I had the live page. Now it's red in the editor. So it knows I'm back in the editor now. I've clicked, I've copied it. It's sitting in the, uh, in the, in the magic cache, but, but uh, the big reveal, boom. There we go. I'm going to hit save now. Oh, copier is now saving. You'll see it's saving in the background there. That's the tip, the, the real click funnel save. I'm going to continue editing so we can leave this page up there. It's just going to refresh. So it builds all of the JavaScript back up again. And then I'm going to press F5. Hopefully we're not cached here. There we go. Nice one. So oh, look, is... it's a ClickFunnels page and I can copy it again. <laughs> 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 so that is, the, that is the live editor. Obviously, um, due to, uh, I guess, copywriting laws, that we, we, we don't want that to be um, with great power becomes great responsibility. We're going to have uh, the version of this that comes out um, will have obfuscation switched on, 
which would basically say, you can take an Eli page you like and you can replicate it. Now we're going to give you the model. We're going to give you a true funnel hacking, which is not stealing people's stuff. It's modeling what they have and making it your own. So we're going to replace images with placeholders and we're going to replace text with lorem, ipsum, etc. So you'll still get the full funnel structure. So it's technically a template, but you're not breaking any rules. So I, two, two things on that. One is uh, with, with regards to images, uh, we are going to, we're, uh, we're going to be identifying um, kind of image for image. So in version three, we're going to be setting it up so that you can actually select an industry. So if you're in real estate, you could select real estate in a drop down menu when you're copying and it'll replicate images. It'll put images and, and some basic real estate text in there. Uh, for your specific industry, real estate or marketing, we're, we're going to look, we're going to see what different industries uh, we can put this in. So that way you can get images that have a bigger, you know, better feel for your own industry. Uh, yeah. And they're all going to be royalty free. So it's all going to be included. You're going to have, um, you won't have to pay for them. You'll have to give credit for them because it's all going to be part of the membership itself. Obviously, the beta, beta people who get on that initial beta list will actually get to determine or predetermine the, the niches that are chosen first. So um, if we get a bunch of real estate guys and some MLM so, guys in, then that's, that's what we'll be focused on. So I, I had a, a, just a thought uh, here, and uh, I, this is probably going to be version six in version six. <laughs> Uh, but so there's like right up, you know, in this template, you've got your name as part of it, right? Your name, best email, your cell phone number, like those things don't need to be replaced. They don't need to be you know, changed with, uh, with base text. Um, is there a way that we could set it up so we could have a drop down um, that would be able to say, hey, let's put back the original text. Or like a, you know what I mean? Yeah, I think I think where where we're going to change it is the headlines and paragraphs. So again, I'm not really interested in button text. Um, get your co copy of the funnel magazine. I mean, you're going to change that. That's always going to change anyway. Um, yeah. If someone came along to replicate the funnel magazine, good luck. Uh, the I don't think this is going to be a problem with the button text. Um, so. I'm actually not going to change any of those, but the, the, those would probably be his headlines. So they're probably going to get replaced. Um, mm. Yeah. I'm just thinking where it says your name, your best email, your cell phone number, the above the actual form field. Above the input element. Um, yeah. So the, the input elements won't change, but the um, text, those would be, one. those would be headlines. That's a, that's a headline text, that one. And yeah. Yeah. Um, those so are headline text. And yeah. these ones down are probably paragraph. Um, so all of that uh, would be replaced. Everything I use is I, all of mine are all headlines. I'm lazy. I just <laughs> use headlines for everything. Because when we code stuff, then I don't have to try to change it to something that's not a headline. So uh, what we can show uh, that's that's going to be available pretty much immediately is the uh, editor version. So if you have access to a page and you want these things like, oh my God, I put it in the wrong page type or um, how do I replicate this? I've put this awesome membership page inside the wrong funnel. Ah, it needs to be in the other funnel. So if you want to be able to sw switch that over in uh, uh, three clicks, then uh, the version that is the editor version. So if I go open up this page, uh, and I'd have the page cloner. This is the free version. Uh, or the demo versions, I should say. This is the the editor version. So the um, I can copy this internally. So I'm copying it from the editor, and then I can go open up a new page. Uh, obviously, they look the same, so this is, doesn't really doesn't really do much for us. Um, it just copies it straight over. But that that's effectively the same thing. I'm copying it from editor to editor. So I have I have access to this page, obviously, inside the editor, um, which would give you the ability to move pages immediately from one funnel to another. Um, remove pages from one page type um, uh, to another page type, opt in to order, order to OTO, OTO to downsell, et cetera, et cetera. Um, so sales page to, so like we just, uh, we just did this actually. Uh, we had a sales page that uh, we turned into an OTO page because we wanted to, to have the offer on the back end 
So I took this really long form sales page and then just uh, replicated it, turned it into an OTO page, and now that's getting added in to the back end of one of our funnels. So um, it also helps if you've got some, if you've got an offer that's converting really well uh, as a front end offer to your existing list, you can take those sales pages, replicate them into uh, an OTO for an existing funnel, and then have them as a one click upsell. Uh, another really really powerful way you can do this: let's say you have a customer list and you want to send them to a webinar and uh, you have two versions of the webinar, one for people who aren't customers and then one for people who are customers, you could send them to a webinar that then sends them to an OTO page. And if you, you just, you can't, you can't create a sales page and then replicate it and, you know, turn it into an OTO page or an opt-in page and turn it into an OTO page. So this allows you to, to move the different page types back and forth, which is really powerful. Yeah, definitely. And, and absolutely time saving. So uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> people, people come, come to us to get this done because they can use, use our service uh, for, for a, a really good price to be able to do that. Uh, but this, this even saves us time. There you go. Boom. And, and uh, by the way, you guys have to click continue in order for it to, uh, in order for you to be able to, to save properly. Uh, one question I know that we're going to get is let's say somebody goes in and uh, is working on this. They want to edit the page itself uh, before they hit save. Can they go and do that? Uh, no. Okay. So when, when the, when the, when the page actually copies over, um, technically it breaks the page. Uh, we, we hold that broken piece and we fix it ourselves internally, but that's what the, the continue and, and exit actually do. So we save the page for you. Um, has to be done by our, our, our extension. Um, and we actually have to refresh the page once that's done. As soon as you refresh though, it's, it's literally like 10 seconds. The whole process is about 10 seconds. Uh, but the, uh, once you actually do save and, and continue, then you're back to having exactly what you need to edit. So you can make all the modifications and hit save as per normal. You don't need to use the extension anymore. Perfect. Um, Trying to think, what what are some of the other cool things that that uh, people are you you, th you think people would want to know about this? Uh, well, I think the 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 idea obviously is um, what what's working out there. It's it's true funnel hacking. Like we we instead of spending months and years working out whether your business idea will actually work, say hi. Uh -huh. You can you can find you can model what's actually working out there. You don't have to be the guy with the arrows in the back. So, um, guy, gal. So the, the, the idea is let's find, money. yeah. <laughs> She's excited for this as much as we are. <laughs> Junior entrepreneur. <laughs> Wait a minute. So the, the idea obviously is that you can, um, you can replicate these models very quickly. Uh, without having, <laughs> without having uh, to spend all that time, you know, co coding and all that sort of stuff. Now, th this type of thing has been around for a long time in WordPress. There's WordPress scrapers and, and all that sort of stuff. So um, this is not a, a huge issue. If you're going to have a look in Theme Forest, I can guarantee you there's thousands of developers in there that have done exactly the same type of thing. So what this really is, is, is the ability to move really quickly um, with funnel pages. Um, I love this idea. I've got this idea where someone else that's doing it, something like that. That, that, that framework is exactly how I want it. Um, uh, we can either go and buy a template. We can go and create our own. Um, we can try and model it. Um, we can spend those hours putting putting the pieces together. Now, the editor itself, ClickFunnels editor itself, is one of the easiest, one of the best I've ever used. But it still takes time. Um, so if we if we're able to build those frameworks out um, uh, in in seconds, and then we add our own images and titles in, it's a, it's a game changer. Absolutely. So you may you probably know this, and and for for those of you who don't know this. Uh, my team and I last year and the year before uh, funnel hacked over 5,000 pages. And we had, uh, I think, depending on the day, we had anywhere between three to seven people funnel hacking pages all day long. And um, so just to kind of give you an idea of like of what we did and <laughs> I, at one point, I so I've actually been doing this for quite a while, and I know you, Nathan, you 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 knew how to copy it back and forth because uh, I think Jamie shared one of the scripts to to be able to copy that, and you guys then created your your little bot for this. Um, 
And I knew that right off, I'm like, there's got to be a better way because there's no way that we can do as many pages as we want to do and be able to, to uh, produce as well as, as we want to produce. And um, we're, we have the most templates in the funnel marketplace. <laughs> you do, you, you've completely dominated, which is awesome. I, I, <laughs> I did. Someone's I, having a great time. I can see Lo that. Lots of good funnel but. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we, we completely dominated in the, in the marketplace and, um, it actually produces really well for us. And we wanted to be able to give that same power for everybody else because, uh, so as part of being a member of FunnelBot, which, uh, complimentary of, uh, funnel fix it and funnel magazine, we're actually giving access to thousands of templates, including, all of the lead pages templates we've replicated uh well probably there are probably new ones since we've done it but we replicated every single lead page template that there was uh up until like mid 2017. we replicated every hubspot template we replicated almost every theme forest template all of that is already included so uh, while you might want to go and hack like these other guys um, lead pages is not very customizable, even though they have like a drag and drop editor, quote unquote, it's, it's not really a drag and drop editor. It's a, it's a you know, quasi drag and drop editor. So we've been able to replicate all of those for you. You're going to get access to those as uh, a member and as a beta tester, which is something that is uh, just going to be a lifesaver for you guys in, in terms of time energy. I mean, I've literally, literally had uh, our guys spend tens of thousands of hours and I've spent tens of thousands of dollars on, on, uh, on having these built for you. So you're going to get access to all of those as part of this, uh, as part of the membership here. Nice one. By the way, um, people will be asking how much, how much, how much for this one to come with you. <laughs> so, so, I know that a big thing for you, and obviously since your your daughter's there, is uh, is to have you know be able to to do this for your family. Um, one of the big reasons for me is my daughter was just born, and uh, it, that really lit a fire up under me to to get this done because I've had uh, our clients have been telling us to get something like this built forever, and I'm so glad that you had uh, you had said that you had something. And that we could partner on this because this is uh, this has been something that has everybody's been asking for from, from our clients because they uh, um, they saw you know what the power of it and how fast we could replicate pages was so I'm super excited to be able to share this with the world and uh, what's the timeline on this how long till this ends up actually going uh, being available in the marketplace so the uh the editor to editor version is ready to go. As we've seen, um, everything functions already at the moment. So the editor to editor version will be submitted to the Chrome store um, probably by the time you're seeing this. So that'll be available. The, uh, the live to obfuscated version uh, with great power comes great responsibility will be available obviously to the beta members uh, and, and further down the line to, um, to, the, the, to, to the members once they've, once they've joined. Uh, we're looking at probably about anywhere between one to two weeks at the moment for the, for the initial beta um, to be live with all of the obfuscation in there. Um, servers being stood up, a uh, bunch of testing is going on at the moment. As, as we said, we want to make sure that we're not taking away too much so that like I replicate a page and literally it's got some sections in it. <laughs> what do I do with this? Um, but at the same time, we want to make sure that it's, it's useful once it, once it comes across. So, um, where we get, we've got to plug in the, um, we're actually got to buy a, a, a license, as you said before, uh, it'll be stock images, but they'll be free. They won't be the, the free, free ones. They'll be free to members, but we, we have to pay for that. So we've got to, we've got to implement an API kind of like ClickFunnels does at the moment. Um, uh, so that's, that's being purchased. Um, uh, the, what else have we got in there? The members area, um, for the members as well, uh, being built out. So it's, it's super cool. It's gonna be awesome, really easy to use. Uh, and it, it, um, also, we're looking at hopefully having this in the beta test, which will have your history in it as well. So uh, you'll have a history of pages that you've you've replicated, so you can pull them out of your library um, and put them into any of your other pages as well. Awesome! And uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I can twist your arm here. Uh, are you cool with that? Yeah. 
All right, cool. So uh, I am going to do something really awesome. As long as you are a member of the FunnelBot, you're going to get a subscription to Funnel Magazine's VIP club, which means that um, not only do you get all of those templates, which uh, is, is basically right now, by the way, just those templates alone, uh, people pay anywhere between $100 to $500 a month, depending on uh, the level of access that they have, depending on if they're an agency or not, and they want to use it for their clients. Um, so you guys are going to get the agency level of that, which is $500 a month value. Uh, then you're also going to get, uh, we already have, by the way, we already have uh, tons of images, which I didn't know you guys were purchasing those. So um, you guys will get all of those in our membership as long as you're a member. And uh, you also get to read Funnel Magazine, which is obviously uh, awesome since that's uh, it's part of it. I would like to twist your arm and find out if you're willing to gift them a month of Funnel Fix It. So if they've got any questions, any problems, any challenges, that they can get uh, at least a month of uh, support from you guys. Since I know that's a service, it's not a, it's not a, it's not something that is digital and can be created once and sold hundreds and hundreds of times. Uh, so can I twist your arm to give them uh, you know a really powerful resource that they can grow their business with? Yeah, well, if, if people are uh, obviously jumping on the beta, then as a teaser, yes. If anything's holding you back on your ClickFunnels stuff, that's what we're here for. That's what Funnel Fix it is. We we not only support ClickFunnels, we do support the entire ecosystem. So anything that plugs into it, whether it's your Shopify store, um, informational stuff, uh, Zapier, custom coding on the page, all that sort of stuff. So yeah, we'd love we'd love to have you and help you out and make sure you're getting those those funnels launched as well. So yeah, sure thing. Perfect. There you go. So you guys got tons of digital bonuses. You're going to get drawings of cats. Drawings of cats. Yeah, absolutely. We'll, uh, we'll commission those. Those are for the, the VI the super VIPs though. Yeah. But you have to, you have to, you have to buy a ticket to our live event that we'll do in like a year. Because... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, awesome. Awesome. Cool, man. Is there, is there uh, let's see, we got, so ver version one is out. Uh, which is the editor to editor version two is about to be out by uh, looks like end of July, beginning of August is when uh, beta, the beta group is going to get access to that uh, version three. We're going to have an uh, API so you can actually pull in images and copy uh, based on your industry uh, version four and five. We're going to um, include other uh, other page types. So WordPress, uh, Pro WordPress is probably one of the bigger ones using Thrive themes. I know that's one of the biggest ones out there. Um, yeah, so it'll be theme based. Um, yeah. uh, you and I have mentioned this before. Um, when we're doing uh, um, uh, WordPress, and I kind of pointed out before that that little Chrome extension that I have, we have the ability to look on a WordPress page that's using a default theme of what that theme is. Now every theme has its own structures, so we can replicate by theme. We can't replicate a WordPress page just by saying it's WordPress. Um, you could, but you're going to end up with a whole bunch of HTML on the page you have to edit. So that, <laughs> that's not really useful. But if I know it's Thrive themes, I know how Thrive theme structures and I can pull those structures in. And when you go into the editor, it'll be within the Thrive themes, actual edited functions. So you can click all the Thrive theme um, um, custom options and make those changes. Same with uh, Studio Press, Genesis. Um, uh, what's the other big one? The big blocky one. Uh, I don't. I don't know anything about WordPress anymore. <laughs> I, I I decided when I found ClickFunnels to forget everything I could ever have possibly learned about WordPress, and it's it's made my life easier. I was the same with Joomla. I still have, I still got one client that's a Joomla guy. I've tried so hard to pull him pull him over. Um, Infusionsoft is the one that we dropped completely. We're not doing that anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, I was gonna gonna say something and then. What does that say? It says, okie dokie. <laughs> As you can tell, we love to have fun and uh, family is a huge part of both of our businesses. So it's, uh, it's definitely a blessing. By the way, it, it's, I don't know what time, what time is it? It's midnight here. It's past midnight here. And uh, what time is it there? Yeah, it's three fifteen. So this is my this is my day shift. I still have a night shift to come. So <laughs> yeah, we we uh, crazy entrepreneurs do all sorts of crazy stuff. So um, awesome, man! Dude, I'm so excited for this. This is uh, this is gonna help so many. People. Uh, 
I also want to include something, uh, something else besides the giggles in the background uh, is if you guys have a page, if you guys have a funnel that you guys would like replicated, but it's not a ClickFunnels page, um, we are, we do have a queue that, that we have to go through, but we will replicate them. We'll put it in our membership area and then in the membership area, you guys can download those. So, um, that way, you know, you can have access to it and, and other members can have access to it. So, and either myself or you know, my team or Funnel Fix It team can, can, uh, get those done and we can, we can do that. It's uh, depending on how big it is, depends on if we can do a complimentary. It'd probably be like one, one funnel per month that we could do uh, with the monthly membership. Um, we'll include a, a specific amount for the beta group as well, just because that's, that's obviously time intensive and cost for us. So great. Awesome, man. Well, I uh, appreciate you for jumping on. Um, We will have this up and we'll have the beta opt in, uh, I think at the end of next week. So you guys will be able to opt in for this, uh, at the end of next week. If you're watching this on Facebook, uh, if not, if you're watching this on the, the opt in page, then well, just opt in below. Yeah. Press the button. <laughs> <laughs> so, awesome, man. Uh, any last words for uh, our awesome community? No, get out there and follow back guys. This is awesome. Good fun. Perfect. Perfect. Have a blessed day, guys. See you on the other side.